Hey guys, welcome back to World of Warplanes. I'm your host, Rune, and today I did some grinding. I also, uh, I bought this guy. So this is like 13 bucks, 13, 14 bucks. It's this guy plus 2,000, um, 2,000 gold plus 100% guy. Um, and it's not that bad of a fighter. I took it around. I was trying to get some silver and everything. Um, I did, um, a battle in the in the four and the five, I did a couple of battles in the um, the six here, the uh, P thirty nine and one. There's been a lot of issues today, like crashing when trying to load into the um, like a match and everything. But we made enough, and then what I made, I made sort of, I made like two million ish, and then um, I realized, you know what, we're probably not really gonna fly the XP seventy two again because. The F2G is the next tier, well, not the next one, but we have the P51 to go, and then the F2G as well, because the F2G has a, has a solo fighter guy that we can train up, or we can, we can try to get the experience to then get it, right? So, like, this is the plan. Um, so I figured I've got two tier eights that I'm going to be, like, maining for a good minute. We're also working on the F7 to eventually get the pancake, so we're really not ever really going to fly the f or the XP-72, so I just put the guy in the hangar, um, and I sold, I sold his plane, I did, that was me, it was mean, I know, but what we can do is we can use some of these modules, I'm hoping, um, except minus this one, let's, let's look, yeah, so we can interchange these guys for free, D-mount, and, um, this is also the ordnance thing as well, so D-mount, so the only thing that we have to buy is this guy. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll have enough money because we're going to be buying this guy. 90% training guy, 3.6. We have 257 left. That... Oh, 300... Oh, oh, no. Okay, because... So, let's look at it. Boom. Oh, man, super cool. <laughs> that's super sick look at you all right so we're gonna need to put in a fire extinguisher check we need to repair ourselves here and we need definitely our first aid kit and then apply so there we go for that and then our upgrades so this is very important reason why i got all that free experience is i am going to we need to get our rockets and stuff. Oh man, look at those rockets. What? Oh, dude. Oh, and we can just buy these ones? Okay, we're not gonna do that right away. But see, look, we can get this. How much do you cost to equal? <gasps> Good crikeys. Oh man, how much are you gonna cost to upgrade? Oh my god, guys. <laughs> so much money. And then, um,. Let's go ahead and research this one and have these these pounders on here. Oh, man, look at that. Okay. <laughs> oh, good Lord. So we can afford this right now. Okay. And we can put on this and we can put on this. And then how much is that one airframe thing? Oh, my God. So what we can do, oh, no, I don't want to do that either. Uh, so we are going to definitely be grinding. So we're not going to have this module for a minute. But what I think I'm going to do is, um, oh, that looks so cool, that upgrade. Because see, look. Yeah. Oh, see the difference? Oh, God, it's so awesome. All right, so if you guys give me a minute, I'm going to go in my... Uh, my depot and i'm gonna try to sell some things and everything and we're gonna try to get the machine gun upgrade because look at that rate of fire look at that that's just so awesome and then that kind of clears the way to make us get into um the experience grind to get into the thunder streak which is super cool we're not gonna do though we're not gonna do that though we're gonna get everything we're gonna research everything before we go for it uh, but anyway all right guys i know it's been like five minutes i've been geeking out in hangar but hold on one second Okay, guys, we are back, and I did sell some equipment and everything, and we have enough to get some awesome stuff. Look at look at our logo on our bird, dude. Oh, that's just so cool. 
Man, this plane looks so sick. Let's quickly, let's quickly, let's go through our paint jobs here. Okay, so we got this one, which is a really dark camo. Then we got this one, <laughs> okay. Then we got this one. All right. And then this one. Interesting. So it kind of plays off of that one, the XP-72 one that we had. That is interesting for sure. So this is the summer concealment. All right. All right. Well, we're going to fly stock anyway. What, well, let's check out the nose stuff. Oh, we can have American flag. <laughs> oh, we can even have cool, cool noses. Oh, God. Super sick. Super cool. All right, anyway, without further ado, guys, so we are just going to, we're 90% we're, we're guy. We don't have our, our crit reduction uh, thing at all. Our maneuverability is good. What's our altitude performance? Uh, optimum is 1,800. Really? So not that not that crazy high up. We're, we're definitely not, you know, a big beast, to say the least, I guess. What's the difference between us? Oh, kind of the relatively same. Okay. Although currently, cool. Okay, anyway, I'm geeking. I'm sorry. We're battling. We're battling. I'll see you guys when we load in. All right, guys. Welcome back to the Alpine Gambit Snow and Ashes map. It looks... Oh, Sergeant Blaze! What? He's in a tier 10 ground pounder. Remember him in, like, the tier 5 or 6? Um, that, like, bombed us a couple of times? We're going to have to be careful about him. Definitely gonna have to be careful about him. I think that is you the only other the player. I think it's just me be and Sergeant ready. Blaze. Crazy. Oh, let's look. Let's take a look. Screenshots. Yep, screenshot one. And do a cool flyby. Oh, sick. <laughs> Guys, super cool. Super cool. I'm really excited about um having the opportunity to use the F2G again um, because I was so focused on getting the, the ooh, Off we hi go. guy, oh yeah, I was so focused on trying to get into um, the Thunderjet that I really stopped playing my F2G or my Mustang for that matter, so these are 500 pound bombs, let's bomb, bomb, and then, oh, dude, rockets for days. Oh, guys, this is so cool. This is not like those cluster rockets, like, um, like on, uh, oh, we're getting cooked. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo! That was pretty cool. What are, what is, what's our guns like? Oh man. Shredtastic. Shredtastic. Okay, so let me finish my words. Uh, so I'm excited to play in my. Um, oh, we hit a tree. Um, to play in my F2G again because the thing is, is we have to get that experience for the fighter. Or uh, for. Yeah, the, the pirate vessel. So there's, there's guys going off everywhere. We did what we can here, guys. There, we can't really do anything else. I'm breaking away to go into the military base. That is definitely something that we got to do. But, um, yeah, like, to do the F2G with um, Jason as Jason's grinding his pancake. There's Sergeant Blaze. Oh, man, there's ground pounders for days over here. Oh, man. Let's see. Yep, they got it. Let's see how awesome... Uh, flaps extended. Oh, oh, you know what? We're going for this guy. There's a pirate. Ooh, I think that's a pirate. Is that a pirate? I don't know. We're chasing him. We're giving chase. Hey, I'm coming for you, Brohim. Hey, come back here. Oh, no, I'm being shot up again. Who is shooting me? Uh, 
Uh-oh. All right, so... Enemy definitely takes a minute to shoot. There we go. <laughs> oh, now we're getting AA'd. Let's drop our bombs. I don't know where that rocket's going. Oh, we got AA'd to death, guys. <laughs> oh, no. A, a defensive aircraft uh, took us out because we are amazingly bad. <laughs> All right, so, hey, we're going to go. We're going to respawn right here um, just basically because, you know, reasons right here. It looks like our air base is okay. One day. There we go. We're going to rocket these guys. We don't need those missiles. We got to rest, um, restart the, the st Oh, man. Blaze. Blaze. I guess this is how you do it. You just ground pound for days and, you know, you win. I guess that's how other people do it. I don't think that's very fun. But that's okay. <laughs> people have their own interesting uh, funness. So we're going to shoot down this guy. He's going first. AA is definitely, or their rear turret guy is definitely a thing, I guess. Okay, got him. Breaking off. Let's go up and around. Sergeant Blaze is right there. Let's try to take out Sergeant Blaze. Now, we have to be careful about bombs. Because Sergeant Blaze likes to drop bombs. This is a known fact. Let's try to... Woo, up. Man, he almost got us. Jeez, what? See, ground pounding, I don't find very fun. You guys let me know in the comments if you guys find that very fun. He's going to pay with his life. Um. Ooh, that guy tried to... Well, that, was, that was very rude. But, uh, you know, that just kind of happened. Uh, <laughs> we took him out. Uh, that makes me kind of happy. Uh, but, yeah, I guess, you know, <laughs> this is just a quick video of um doing it maybe we should do another one i don't really want to get ground pounded in objective but like when there's just 1v1 and a whole bunch of bots you really can't gauge your awesome plane and that's really unfortunate i would really like to um i think robert has um he's got the starfire he's also got the um the the tier 9 heavy which is a super cool plane too it looks super cool anyway man we're all, you know we just we just got to we just got to hang out with some people. We're going to try to get some guys. Yeah, I only shot down three guys. Um, I helped capture A sector. Um, we did lots of bombing and everything. But, yeah, that's just a quick little... What is this? This is a tier 10 ground pounder. I mean, good for him. I just... I don't, I don't think I would like ground pounding because it's just... You fly in a straight line, you shoot ground targets, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, guys. What do you think of ground pounding um, aircraft and is... Do you think that it is a fun kind of uh, uh, mode or, or uh, what, is, what is the words I'm using for? It? Yeah, the, is it a fun kind of uh, role for you and uh, all that? Because I don't know. I don't really think it would be that fun, to be honest. I think it would be kind of, you know, everybody and their brother comes and tries to shoot you down. And, <laughs> and you... You can drop bombs, and hopefully you can kind of get them in the splash. But, you know, like, I, I die to start Blaze's splash all the time. This time we didn't. But, you know, that's just kind of like a quick first look at our Thunder Jet, guys. Um, I'd love to do some more Tier 9 battles and stuff with Robert and even his 10. He's got, like, a Tier 10 or something like that. And since, you know, I have a 9, he can do his 10, and then that'd be super kind of cool. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Like I said, just a quick one. You know, he's been like five minutes in the hangar and then like a quick defeat. Um, just to kind of see its basic abilities and everything. The machine guns, it seemed like it took forever to kill that one fighter, I do want to say, before we end the video, is that the um, the machine guns did feel a little uh, weak. But the rate of fire is insane. 1,200. 
you know. Um, but it's nothing like the Vulcans, I guess. Like if we get, if we can get into uh, these guys right here, these guys are apparently where it's at because look at that, eight hundred damage per second. Rate of fire is three thousand. Effective range is eight hundred and twenty. You know, like holy crap, guys. That's what we're going to be looking into. Oh, look, we can research this, uh, but we're not going to. We're going to get these first, and then we're going to get these, and then it's going to be awesome. Then we're going to get our engines, too. So we've got lots of Tier 9 stuff to do, um, and we, we're just going to be interchanging our equipment out and everything. It's so expensive up in the Tier in the tier 9s, <laughs> guys. But anyway, enough of my rambling. We're going on, 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 on. Um, but welcome to the Thunderjet, guys. I feel excited. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, like, leave a comment what you think about the Ground Pounder stuff. Join our Discord. We uh, do Friday flight nights all night long, basically. Um, some, some of it's recorded, and then we just play for fun, whatever game. Warships, tanks, planes, you name it, we'll do it. You, you just got to, like, say, hey, why don't we play this game? And if we all have it, we'll, we'll go do it. We don't necessarily have to play wargaming stuff. You know, this is about building a community. You know, I really want to build a community to where we're, we're just all, you know, avid gamers like that love all different sorts of genres that want to, you know, do that stuff. Uh, because I also do RPGs. I'm currently doing a middle Earth Shadow of War. And anyway, ramble, 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 ramble words. I will see you guys in the next episode, which is later today. Like seriously in like uh three to four hours because it's two o'clock my time right now we're going to be doing our event in the evening trying to get a hold of robert before he goes off to do his own thing so anyway later guys take care